Hey, this is Michael Lindsay from Vital MX, and we have a little bit of a news update in regards to the 2022 Motocross of Nations Team USA lineup. So, if you've been checking out the news the last couple weeks about this, it really looked like it was going to come down to one of two 450 riders getting a spot. It was either going to be Christian Craig dropping down to the 250 for our MX2 rider or Justin Barsha. Barsha took the uh, first shot, per se, by riding a fully prepped Red Bull Gas Gas TLD 250 out of Glen Helen eh, about a week or so ago. We caught that on a uh, video that's actually up on our YouTube channel right now. And we know that Craig was preparing to ride one during this break after Washugal himself, as the team is to be decided and announced by the Unadilla Outdoor Pro Motocross National, which is coming up here in a couple weeks after the, the break we usually have for Loretta Lynn's during this summer. However, we can say that one rider is now out of the running um, after trying to connect with Jasparsha about a rumor that he may actually race the last four rounds on 250 to prepare uh, for his bid for that MX2 spot. It's actually been decided that he will pull his bid or his request per se to be on the 250 for the U.S. Destinations team. He feels as if um, that right now at the time, he has to put a lot of focus into the 450 and finishing out his season here in the U.S. strong. And with that, he say just does not feel like he can put in the proper practice, testing time, and just overall focus on the 250 required to really give Team USA his all and give us the best chance of winning, which in my opinion is super respectful. It's really hard to want to back out of a, you know, for a lot of riders, it's a huge opportunity in their career to go. Even though Justin's gone a few times, he's definitely somebody enjoys it. So to basically be able to stand up and go, hey, I can't put in all the effort required to bring two USA back to the top. Yeah, I understand it. So it really makes us wonder now who will be the guy. So we just said it was supposed to be down to two guys. And if the one has raised his hand and said, I can't put, put everything in that's needed, we would think it would default to Monster Energy star Yamaha's Christian Craig. But of course, there's been a lot of chatter now with Justin Cooper really kind of coming up to more of what we expect from him performance-wise in the last couple rounds. Maybe it comes down to him and Craig. This leaves us with one certainty. Whichever rider goes will be on a Monster Energy star Yamaha Racing YZ250F, which I think anybody watching this can agree is not a bad choice to have on the team. So... That's exciting news for tonight. It kind of gets us a little bit closer to getting to see who it's going to be this year. It's going to be definitely an exciting uh, motocross of nations being back here in the States. Um, some amazing strong competition from Team France, uh, Belgium, the Netherlands, Australia all have great lineups that are being announced right now. And we're hoping to put out a little bit more content in relation to all those team announcements over the next week or two. If you like this feature, please give us a thumbs up, subscribe, and like. Make sure you stay tuned for more content here on Vital MX.